And today we're gonna do a mukbang slash Q and A. Yes. Um, let's show y'all the food first. Got some. We got a crab boil here, <laughs> cooked by me. <laughs> if you was if you was juicy crab, if you was juicy crab, you would love that, wouldn't you? <laughs> I sure would. We got the gloves ready because I'm just not in a mood to make a mess. So we got we use our uh, medical gloves because these are way better than yes. the big like plastic gloves that they give you. Y'all should try it. Like Maybe. we take eating seafood. <laughs> Like if you follow us on social media, Instagram, TikTok, crab legs is our favorite. Or wings, because that's Lindsay's other favorite food. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But she'll eat crab legs 10 days a week. Yeah, I would. I really would. It's <laughs> She's gonna good. turn into a little crab. And as long as you wanna eat me. <laughs> Let's tell them what we got. Oh, okay, okay. So we got a cluster each of crabs. Of mm. course, we got snow crabs. We got corn, sub potato for corn. Mm -hmm. I did that too. I usually don't do that, but I did that today because I was like, eh, I don't need a potato. We got shrimp, no head, and we got the black mussels. Mm -hmm. We'll do a little Q&A for y'all. You already know what the question is that everybody asks on every video. What do y'all do for work? <laughs> well, I don't know why that's y'all's most asked question. Let me tell you right now. Yeah, go. I'm a medical assistant in sports medicine. And that's it. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm um, site manager of a clinical research site. Mm -hmm. Don't say it like that. She got promoted. She can't say it like me when my dad said it. Like she got a big, big girl job over here. <laughs> so are you, baby. I know, but I'm happy for your promotion still. Thank you, baby. But um, yeah, so I work in clinical research. Um, I do psychiatric drug trials. Um, here, yeah, in Atlanta. Mm -hmm. And I know y'all are gonna have more questions about that, so I was gonna try to go into detail, but <laughs> it is what it is. And if I get sauce in my mouth, mind your business. Yeah, cause she be, when she be eating, it just be dripping down her chin. <laughs> like, she eat everything dripping down her chin. Stuff that don't even normally be dripping down her chin. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right, let's jump into it. What, this wasn't asked either, I don't think, but mm -hmm. how old are? you how old are we oh uh, we're both 27 we're both 27 um i'm older yeah clearly grown mature different vibe different energy i got me a sugar mama oh sugar mama girl this is a fair relationship all equal rights over here mm. that's true um she was born in april i'm may 94 aries babies over here yeah she's an aries i'm a taurus Best sign. Okay, who who's the bigger crybaby? Um, I feel like it depends on the timeline. When we first met, what well, what you gonna say? Oh, I know what you're talking about. Yeah. When we first like, met, it was like it was Lindsay. Like she was more emotional than me and would cry more often. And like, <laughs> I really was crying. <laughs> Listen. I don't know what it was. Long distance was hard for me. <laughs> I was getting in my feelings. Yes, I sure was a big crybaby. You was crying. Mm -hmm. And then she kind of softened me up. We would talk a lot about emotions. And the long distance was softening, softening me up too because I struggled with the long distance a little bit. And we would be trying to tell each other don't cry. But as soon as she closed that door, I was crying. <laughs> yeah. But, and now. Now I just be crying and yeah. I don't care. Yup, I'm gonna cry baby. I be crying now for everything. I was crying last night in bed. I don't even know why. <laughs> and what? I'm like, why are you crying? <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> she really do. Oh. <laughs> Something was making me cry and I was crying. And Lindsay was like, why are you crying? I was like, I'm okay. She was like, what did I do? I'm sorry. I was like, you didn't do nothing. I'm just crying. Mm -hmm. and, yeah. She was just crying. So, yeah, I guess it just, <laughs> we're, right now we're in a part of a relationship where she's crying. And Lindsay More. just trying to figure out why. And I'm not crying. because like of anything like uh, in our relationship. Or yeah, I know. Like, nothing, nothing <laughs> like. Like make her cry. Yeah, she's not doing anything. It's just like recently, 
I've grown so much in a relationship, like mental health wise and just being able to communicate. So sometimes I just get a little like, wow. Or sometimes I just be crying because I'm happy. Like, oh my God, like I can't believe like, this is my life. Like I'm with the person that I always wanted to be. It's crazy. Um, all right, next vacation spot. We're going to New York Pride. <laughs> <laughs> New York Pride, if anyone's going, we'll be there. And yes, June yes. For just a weekend, but yeah, if y'all see us, come say hey. Literally just the weekend. We going what? Um, Saturday to Monday. Mm -hmm. Leaving Monday. That's what we like to do. We like to go on little weekend trips, because like then you don't have to use a lot of PTO. Mm -hmm. Just go have a nice little weekend and then come back. Yeah. Back. That's going to be fun. We decided. Mm -hmm. Mm, this is bomb. Yeah, let me get a bite in. <laughs> <laughs> you good, baby. Okay. What's your favorite ice cream flavor? Cookie dough. Vanilla ice cream with cookie dough. Not any type of cookie dough ice cream. But also only cold stones. Because everybody cookie dough ice cream don't be hitting the same. Oh my god, cold stone. Oh. She put me on to like, well, cold stone. And ice cream, like, yep. I'm like a more of like a savory person, not a dessert yeah. person. But she was getting ice cream a lot, and I was eating. All and we started that. getting like the, oh, look at this! Oh my look god! At this. Ah. Stop! <laughs> I haven't even eaten any crab, have I? Mm -hmm. All right, let okay, me get into this. Up. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> but yeah, Cold Stone. Mm. Fire. Mm -hmm. Mine is, I would say cookie dough now. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. I thought you were gonna say um, the fish food that you be getting. Nah. Not anymore. I thought I liked fish food, but I don't like it that much. Which flavor from Coastal? I'm licking my pinky because I'm trying to get the sauce off so I can swipe on my phone. I don't now lick I my told, gloves. Now I told her, I said, we should write down the questions mm -hmm. on a piece of paper so we can just look at the paper. And she was like, no, no, I figured it out. I'm just gonna use my pinky and scroll. Now she licking butter off her gloves. <laughs> Got latex in her mouth because she didn't want to listen to me. Okay. I know your mouth tastes like crab legs and latex. <laughs> okay, girl, <laughs> I ain't gotta explain. <laughs> okay, ever, a lot of people ask, do y'all want kids? And if so, how many? We want at least two to three is what we both like kind of talked about. Yep. And we both want to carry. Yes. And we will um, probably look for a donor. Mm hmm And who, they also ask who wants to carry first. Or if we have three, who will carry again? Ooh, not me. <laughs> Did we decide you were gonna go first or me? Uh, me. Yeah, I think her going first. She wants to just get it out of the way. Mm -hmm. Like in the best way possible. Like yeah, I'm yeah. excited for that experience, but the way my health been lately, I just, I don't need no more added stress on this body, honey. Yeah. And you know, it could be a great pregnancy, but pregnancy is hard. The thing I'm scared about is two things. Losing my hair. I don't wanna have and they hair do be losing their yeah. hair. Mm -mm. I worked hard for my hair. But then again, on a positive, some people, some people's experience are completely different. I'm not acting like all pregnancies are awful. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Obviously some people, want to do it, yeah. Yeah, and some people like, their hair get longer, thicker, they body, I don't know. I don't know, I really know the positives about the body. <laughs> I guess, you That's know. That's the other thing. They be glowing. I feel like Victoria's gonna snap back. <laughs> like, I just oh. know it, you are, and I'm gonna be out here Looking beautiful as ever. No, looking like a bitch. No, you're gonna be out here looking beautiful as ever, baby. Period. That's it. I hope so. You will. Cause I told her I got her. Yeah. Cause she's scared her body gonna snap back into shape, but that's why I'm gonna make sure we going for little walks. We're taking our baby for walks. Like we're gonna have a routine. If you need me to get a trainer, put them on retainer. Saw that rhyme. Ooh, she got money. She gonna give me a trainer. I got you. I'll figure it out. Um. Okay. Mmm. I feel like y'all not understanding how good this is right now. Oh yeah, it's really good. Really good. Tell, Cause we definitely tear it mm -hmm. up. Who takes the longest in the bathroom? To do what is a better question. <laughs> Don't expose me. <laughs> if we're talking to about- To get ready for a date? You. 
Yes, it does. And I know y'all looking like, well, she don't even have no hair. Don't worry about all that. Yes, it takes me longer than her. Mm -hmm. But on a casual day where somebody be on the toilet just scrolling and scrolling and scrolling and scrolling and scrolling. I don't even okay. feel like she be using Next. a bathroom. I don't even feel like she be using a bathroom. She swears scrolling. I go in, she thinks I go in the bathroom. To avoid responsibilities. To get away from her. No. Like, every time I get up, I, I gotta go to the bathroom. You're like, what? No, you don't. Mm -hmm. Every time I'm trying to walk the dog, oh, I gotta use the bathroom. I'm like, dramatic, dramatic. All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> who does the dog listen, speaking of the dog, who does the dog listen to the most? The alpha. Who does Bryson and hey, Carisha listen to the most? Hmm. I'll let Lindsay tell you that. <clears throat> huh? He listens to Victoria. Cause, Cause I'll play yeah. with him. And I, she be playing with him. I definitely like spoiled him too much and now he does, just doesn't listen to me, but he def he listens to you though right away. He is he has like attachment issues with Lindsay. Yeah. He's spoiled Ryan. Mm -hmm. I mean, he is. And that can be an issue sometimes. Like sometimes he won't even eat unless Lindsay tells him to eat. What? What <laughs> dog do you know don't eat his food? He's a grown man and I have to sit there and be like, eat. Where's your favorite places to shop? Mm. And somebody asked also, how Publix. do you piece together? Oh, sorry. <laughs> Yeah. No, babe, you're close. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna say Publix be having everything. Fresh. <laughs> oh my god, this girl said Publix. And they and they sells be snacking. Mm -hmm. mm. No, favorite place to shop for clothes. Mm. Lately, I shop online mostly. Um, I never was a huge fan of going to the mall. Mm -mm. And. Since I met Lindsay, she's always fine to return things because I also don't be feeling like returning things. It's like, it feels so tedious. I don't care if, if what I bought is ugly as heck. I will not return it if, if I got it online. If it doesn't fit work. her, if nothing. It's too much work. But um, I normally buy for a pretty little thing right now. And if it doesn't fit me, if it's too big because I'm short, I finally got smart enough or mature enough to just decide to go take it to the... um. What it Taylor. is. Taylor. I take it to the tailor now, yeah. I get it fitted. If oh, speaking wrong. of, I'm supposed to pick something up tomorrow. We be getting a lot of stuff tailored. <laughs> Sorry. We also like Fashion Nova sometimes. Yeah, sometimes. They be hit Pretty rest. Little Thing is like her go-to though. That is my go-to. Um, yeah, I'll return stuff for her. Where else? I like Walmart because you normally, people really be surprised, but like I get, where we get a lot of our graphic shirts from there. Mm -hmm. And we just wear graphic shirts like casually or with a cute fit and it works. Mm -hmm. Listen. But don't be everybody going to Walmart because they already load, load Listen. the graphic shirts lately. Exactly. And what I'm telling y'all is y'all always like, where do, you, where do you shop? Where'd you get that shirt? And I'm getting embarrassed. <laughs> Not that there's anything wrong with it, but I have to say Walmart every single time because it's from Walmart. <laughs> Everything. <laughs> it's not also it's not where you shop it's just how you put what it together. you look yeah what how you put it together and what you search like what i do if i see something i like like an outfit you can get the gist of what they're wearing so you type it in like mm -hmm. five what is it five inch inseam shorts mm -hmm. oh amazon pops up period perfect yeah. and then it's cheap and i'm like very I don't spend a lot of money, so. Yeah, she's very frugal. Yeah. I'm more likely to buy her the expensive things that I know she wants. Yes. And I get my shoes on GOAT. If y'all wanna know. And when my I Jordans, get like my sneakers and stuff, mm -hmm. GOAT and StockX. Yeah, when I buy her new shoes, it's from StockX. What made y'all start TikTok? I, for me, it was, I was on Twitter. If y'all know, well, now y'all know that we met on Twitter. So I was always on Twitter. Mm -hmm. And, And <laughs> they started putting a lot of um, like TikToks on Twitter and like they were funny. Mm -hmm. You know, if they're funny enough, they'll end up on Twitter. So I was like, okay, this app must be like, something must be going on over here. Mm -hmm. So I was like, all right, let me go download it. Hooked instantly. So I just started making stupid ones. <laughs> and then I was like showing you, I think like you didn't have it for a little bit. Mm -hmm. 
she was just like in the background of mine or like maybe in one of mine or something and then she just you just ended up downloading it i guess like every time we was laying together she would be on it scrolling sometimes so i started watching them and i was like dang these kids kind of funny because you know at the beginning of when tiktok became popular it was mainly kids on it it was <laughs> or like at least that's all we were seeing were like teenagers and i was like dang these kids are kind of funny mm -hmm. so I, I liked it so then i was like i'm a i'm gonna download it and i downloaded it and it's hard to be on tiktok without actually making your own video because there's so many things that you see or trends where you like Ooh, i'm sorry y'all my voice shaking because i'm freezing it's cold in this house because i'm hot my voice shaking <laughs> lizzie <laughs> <laughs> oh my god when I first made a video and it was just me and Lindsay like we was just vibing if you go like to our very first video we was really just vibing it was cute it was cute very cute I like that video you look beautiful in that video oh, thank you baby you're beautiful you now but you know in that video so yeah that's how we joined TikTok okay best memory or okay best memory and what do y'all like what do you like to do just in general the most with each other when um i was living in tampa she came up to visit me and we drove to clearwater beach and we got crab legs that day we ate them on the beach like it was so nice it was like it was just like a beautiful setting the sun was setting not a beautiful setting the sun was setting <laughs> but the sun was setting mm -hmm. and we was eating crab legs on the beach mm -hmm. um it was romantic aside from me getting chased <laughs> by what was it doves seagulls No, that was the funniest thing. It ever. was not. It was not. I was and that's not. the day I should have known you were a drama queen. I was running for my life on the on the beach. Like we were supposed to be having a cute romantic date, and I was literally running for my life. <laughs> Fight for they my was life out here because they was fighting me for my crab legs. I'm like, we by the ocean. All y'all food in there. I came with my food. Y'all food in the ocean. <laughs> it's seasoned out here. They wanted this one. So that day ended up being really fun because then we started to walk like along the beach holding hands and stuff. <laughs> um, but by the way, y'all, she is like a hopeless romantic. Like she loves like just like romance. I mean, I do too, of course, but like you love like movies and stuff. and like I do. Just like, so it's so cute. Like whenever you... Like, I know what you're thinking about right now. Like, you were thinking we were in a little movie. <laughs> Walking on the beach. But that's how it felt. I like, know. that day, it felt like I was in some type of movie. So we started walking the beach. And we ended up walking towards this pier. Mind you, like, we didn't know what type of events was going on. We didn't even know it was a pier there. Mm -hmm. Like, everything just was so, like... What's the word? Like everything just it's like worked out. Yeah. Really, like really cool and nicely. And it was beautiful weather. And like that's one of the reasons why like, it was my favorite date. Like the world just kind of started to bring it all together for us. Like we got to the pier. We're walking on the pier. There were like live shows. And I remember this guy was playing the saxophone and we were standing on the bridge, like, or whatever. The pier, like the bridge. What's it called? The pier. It's a pier but it's a bridge okay we were standing on that and it was already nighttime so we could see the city lights and the ocean was just completely dark so you saw the city lights and then the guy playing the saxophone mm -hmm. what and then we saw i think we got ice cream you got ice cream or maybe i did too i remember that mm -hmm. we got ice cream yeah and then, and then we were like just on the boardwalk and there was like like a fire show yeah this like guy like trying to get out of a straight jacket it was just like, like it was like actually entertaining it wasn't like no corny show like he yeah, was, was really, really cool he was really amazing we were like what like uh -huh. this is so cool <laughs> what was your favorite I'll always cherish that one um favorite memory mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. i mean that's definitely one of them oh our anniversary which one fort lauderdale mm. this past one that was a really nice trip it was. Yeah, it was fun. She wanted a hotel, she wanted a beachfront, and we got there and it wasn't beachfront. And so <laughs> he told me like, you know, it's gonna be this much more. And I was like, F it, like we're doing it cause that's what we wanted. And then we got, we got like the nicest hotel. We had we like there. a two bedroom suite, y'all. Mm -hmm. I was looking like, at Lindsay like, we could afford mm -hmm. this. <laughs> no. <laughs> 
<laughs> no, it was just like that whole like um, trip was just fun. And then we saw your family and everything. So that yes, was my mom made us a big brunch and it was so beautiful. She surprised me. Tell them about the surprise. So I, was, I got her this like sunset cruise thing because it was our anniversary. So I like one day I picked out this like sunset cruise. <sighs> I'm so silly. Why? <laughs> Cause why? I know I can't get on boats and I, I still get on boats. And <laughs> I didn't even think about it that I would get seasick on this boat. You tried to get on a boat for me. Yeah. Oh, my hand's dirty. And then I got seasick and I was literally puking the whole yes. whole thing. That was our two year anniversary. So that was like almost, well, October will be our three year anniversary. Mm -hmm. But I, I enjoy that trip. Actually, wait, nice. what's today's date? I think we met. We met three years ago yesterday. Oh no, is it the 22nd? I Girl, I couldn't tell 16. you. <gasps> I mean, it's let not me our anniversary. Wait, let me think. Let me think. You don't know. Girl, you, you're just gonna say yes. Hmm. What's today? Is it 15th? I think we met on the 12th. No, that's our anniversary, October 12th. We met. I think it was June 16th, three years ago. And then she asked me to be her girlfriend October 12th, so that's why she's saying the 12th. Yep. He took a long enough. This was fun. I'm glad we did a mukbang. This is our first mukbang. We kind of been like, we've been wanting to do mukbang since we decided we wanted to do YouTube. But yeah. I love a good mukbang, so hope y'all enjoyed it. Let us know what other videos y'all want. Yeah, because I'm a slow eater, so if y'all expecting me to finish this before the video is over, think again. I smashed that. And I'm a slow eater. Honestly, we usually get fries too. And sometimes I'll put, well last time I put the ramen in it. Mm. And I will still eat it all, so this was light work for me. Mm -hmm. Let us know what other videos y'all want us to do. Yes. Oh, so keep up with us. We're gonna try to do it for at least every week for now. Yeah. But yeah, um, do the little outro. You do it. <laughs> if you gonna nod your head, you might as well do it. Like, comment, subscribe. Period. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>